In 2018, our city will commemorate its founding 300 years ago. In celebration, WYS presents this tricentennial moment. With over 100 one-man shows in galleries and museums around the U.S. and showings in France and the former Soviet Union, artist Roland Golden's work is collected and admired around the world. Born on November 8, 1931, it all started very early for this New Orleans native. It started with me as a baby. My, my father was uh, talented in art, and I don't ever remember not being with a pencil or something like that. And uh, I enjoyed it very much, and I spent all my spare time drawing. After leaving the Navy in 1955, Golden followed his passion by enrolling in the McCready Art School on Bourbon Street in the French Quarter and studied under the well-known Southern artist John McCready. After graduation, Golden soon opened a gallery on Royal Street, where his own artistic style became evident. I started out with a, a drawing, how to do what I'm going to do with all these paintings, and then uh, I used that as a guide for the painting itself. Most of these things you've seen in, I either made them up or I saw them, but they're not exactly what I saw. And uh, for the sake of composition, I was one thing that Mr. McCready was very, very strict about was composition, drawing and composition. And he was, of course, he was a great painter himself. And uh, I will, uh, that's why I do my little line drawings or pencil drawings beforehand, to get established where I want uh, things to be in the painting. And even when I'm painting, I may change things. Golden describes the paintings that he creates with a hard edge watercolor technique as abstract realism. And the watercolor is definitely the hardest rated medium of them all. For one thing, it's hard to correct watercolor. You know, if you make a mistake in it, you pretty well are stuck with it unless you figure out something to cover it up. But for some reason, I was strangely attracted to it. He's also attracted to the southern landscape and the stories of the people who inhabit its varied topography. You want to try to do things that are uh, creative but different as much as you can. And that's what I try to do. So it's, it's, a, it's a difficult living, but it's also a very interesting one. And for his audience, there is always a fresh perspective on the shared experience of calling the South home. I'm Tom Gregory, and this is your Tricentennial Moment. WYS's New Orleans Tricentennial Moments are brought to you by the Miro Foundation and presented in association with the historic New Orleans Collection.